<clears throat> comparison operators in JavaScript are used to compare two values and tell us something about how those two values compare to each other. Here are the arithmetic Here are the comparison operators in JavaScript. We have equality, inequality, strict inequality, strict equality, strict inequality, greater than, less than, greater than or equal, or less than or equal. And when I use these, instead of returning a number or a mathematical result, what they return is either true or false. Now, let me give you an example of how that works. Okay, so I've got A and B here still set to 10 and 4. And I'm going to delete those increment operators that we used last time. And I'm going to say use the test for equality, which basically says is A equal to B? Not A is equal to B, but is a equal to b so what what i'm going to get here is either true or false in this space indicating whether a which is 10 is equal to b so obviously the answer should be false in that case if i test for inequality i have the exclamation point and an equal sign what I'm asking is, is A not equal to B? And the, the answer to that question is true. A is not equal to B. And now if you get into these double negatives, it can get a little bit tricky, but that's how equality and inequality are. So if something is false when we test for equality, then it should be true when we test for inequality. Strict equality and strict inequality are a little bit more extreme because let me tell you that this if I say is a equal to B and I'm using the regular test for equality obviously this is the number 10 and this is a string that compares to 10 but since they are able to be evaluated to the same thing meaning this can be turned into or imagined as the number 10, the test for equality comes back true. But if I put a third equal sign here, and I have three of them now, what I'm saying is, is A exactly the same thing as B? Exactly the same. And is it exactly the same? No, it's not. So I get a false. Okay. Now the test for strict inequality is an exclamation point with two equal signs after it. And of course, this is true, that they are strictly unequal, not the same. Greater than and less than and greater than or equal than uh, will work pretty much exactly the way you think they would. So if I say is great A greater than B, it's true. Is A less than B? It's false. Is A less than or equal to B? That's true. But if, if B becomes 9, that becomes false because B is now less than A. So A is not less than, nor is it equal to B. So those are the comparison operators in JavaScript.